the price of rice is the president Can't you see that I'm in my element I might just decide to slide on my enemies I go along on a glide for the hell of it Hey guys, it's your girl Kayla Love And I'm back with another video As you can see by the title, I'm gonna be doing Story time on my first kiss Oh, it was dreadful man it was hectic, it was chaos, it was just too much, it didn't need to be. It really didn't need to be. Okay, let's get into the video. One of these ones. Yeah. Watch the intro. Oh. No, it wasn't just randomly, oh, let me just help somebody. It wasn't like that, okay? I had a crush on this person, okay? We're gonna call him Dope Man. So, Dope Man was friends with my friend, because basically, she's, um, she's egyptian and he's also egyptian so they had that common ground and it was just always vibes in you know yeah so they were friends and obviously i was friends with her we're gonna call her crazy if you know her she is crazy so joke man and crazy were friends i was friends with crazy so every time she would go and like speak to him in school i was just like there and i'm just thinking oh my god i really like him bro he's so he was one year older than me like he was a year above me so i was like oh my days like wow like oh my god the way that they were like talking to each other it seemed like to me in my perspective it seemed like she liked him so i was like oh i can't like him because she likes him so one day i went and asked her oh like do you like joke man like because if you like him like i won't like him like do you like him and she's like what that's my guy that's my g man do your thing okay what well, you like him i'll even chat you up for him bro I'll, I'll i'll what's that thing you know when like you talk of a person like to the other person yeah yeah so that's what she was gonna do for me so i was like safety I'm like yeah come so she came back to me and she said oh yeah he said that like he likes you too and i'm like <laughs> so i found out that he liked me back so i was like okay swear down so that was the crush part now fast forward now it's sports day and sports day was good there was two two eyes being caught you know like <laughs> you know and then sports day was done and we came back um to school because we did it in was a sports center and then we came back to school so we came off the bus everyone was like okay cool we're gonna chill we're gonna chill now and it was me crazy my friend new york that's what we're gonna call her new york yeah so i was looking to hang out with my three friends crazy um new york that's what we're calling new york and we're calling the other friend hamster so us three we're gonna hang out we're gonna chill you know in the area but then i bought into joke man and he was like hey like i want to i want to like i want to give you something like i want to like I have a gift for you like something like that he was just moving like he wanted to give me something so i was like oh okay like let's go then and he said all right we're cool we're like cool so we walk like past the school we go down the street down the street and then there's this graveyard like near a bus stop and we're like cool let's go in here so i'm like okay so, yeah. <laughs> the ambiance was different because it was even raining that day <laughs> okay i don't know listen the figures yeah that graveyard is not scary like it's just a, it's a small little mini graveyard there's a little church it looks a bit abandoned but we're not gonna we're not gonna talk about that part anyway so we go into the graveyard and we go behind the church like because the, the main road is like here and the church is there and then we had to like, walk around and go behind the church so we were walking around and we went behind the church and i was still with my three friends plus him we were standing there like looking at each other and like he was moving a bit sketchy not sketchy but like a bit nervous and he was like right so now my friend new york pulls me to the side like yo so he's saying that he wants to kiss you and i'm like okay why does he do it and he's like oh because like oh, it's just like you know it's just a bit, you know he's a bit nervous a bit awkward for him so i said okay cool so we come back and i'm like okay you guys can't look because that's that makes it more awkward so you guys can't look how did new york send um Send Hamster to stand in the corner. <laughs> so Hamster was standing in the corner with the cobwebs and the pipe dream. And she's just standing there like this, facing the wall. I was like, right, naughty corner like that. That's crazy. Um, New York was there. She was the coach. <laughs> okay. And 
crazy was just like yo it's taking a bit long you guys need to speed it up so we can hang out so i'm standing there and he told me to close my eyes so i'm there like this my eyes closed like this and then he comes into me like this like, okay if i sit this way he comes into me like this and he just it's like it's as if he pressed his face on me like he just and i'm just like oh my god and then no no but he no the way that he moved yeah it was like it was the best kiss ever it was the best that i've ever had he pressed his lips onto mine and then he gave me a hug like immediately after and i'm just like i was looking around like i was looking at my friends behind him like yeah i'm looking at them like yeah this is not it bro. You know? <laughs> long day man long day so we were like okay cool we kissed now and then we left I, honestly i don't remember what happened after that but like nothing important we just left we must have hung out or we went home something but that was the kiss section. So now fast forward to the week after that. If you guys don't know, I'm like a drama guru. Well, maybe not a guru, but I did like performing arts in school. I was in year eight. And obviously he was in year, one, in year nine. So yeah, I was in my first ever like performance. I was gonna sing. If you guys don't know, I'm a singer. Insert clip now. Still got time. I still believe in good day. Who is inside? Well, you guys done me. I'm inside the clip. I'm inside the clip. So I was gonna sing um hairspray good morning Baltimore. If you guys remember man. I don't have a I don't have a video of that first performance, but I have a video of when I did it the second time and it's actually much better. Okay, if you saw me a video of me doing it the first time, you'd be like, she can't sing, she can't sing. Yeah. But insert clip now, now insert clip. <laughs> So yeah, I was gonna sing Good Morning Baltimore. I was literally the opening act, very nerve wracking. But yeah, that's what we're gonna do, right? So on that day, it was rehearsals and it was the show. So it was like the last rehearsal. During the time that I kissed um, Joke Man, I also liked somebody else. <laughs> that sounds mad, you know? Oh my God. Yeah, so I also had a crush on somebody else and it was just a bit of a sticky situation because i didn't want to be with both of them so i was just like oh how am i gonna break it to them like how am i gonna tell them like yo i don't want to be with you i don't want to be with you like it's a long day so i finally broke it to them and the second guy was we're gonna call him peanut head <laughs> yeah so peanut head like he was like oh you don't want to be with me oh, i'm a bit <laughs> i'm sad but and I see what's going on, okay, calm, right? Joke man, on the other hand, was like, what, you don't wanna be with me? All right, bet, let me tell you what he did after our conversation. Basically, it was rehearsals, obviously, so I went back to the main hall with, um, with Hamster, because everyone, all of the friends that I mentioned before was in the show, so Hamster Crazy and New York was in the show. And so we went to the hall to do rehearsal because it was like, what, lunchtime? Um, so we went into the hall, we were doing rehearsal and then um, our drama teacher sent us to Reaper Graphics, like the printing kind of room to get like, I don't know, something, posters, I don't know, leaflets, I have no idea. But we went there, me and Hamster, I actually wasn't even supposed to go. That's how crazy this is. I was supposed to be in the hall, but I was like, let me go with her. Because she's stagehand, so she was supposed to go. I was like, let me go right so me and hamster went to um reprographs okay came back and new york and um new york and crazy were like oh my days um joke man came in and he was just on a rampage thing he was talking about how you were ho and how you were salat and how um you're just lips and everybody and i'm just like what in the world i literally spoke to him like 20 minutes ago and this is what's going on so now I'm like, my heart sank. I'm like, oh my god, now everyone's gonna think I'm a hoe and I'm a slut and I'm just lips and everyone. Even though I know that I'm not doing that. I was like, okay, calm, it's okay, like, it's cool, like, everything's gonna be fine. Okay, so we're fasting forward to when the show is like about to start. So the way that the school's set up, like, at the time, 
um, the halls like like let's say the halls here and where we were changing was in like the food tech section so if you go like a bit up it was it was like it was nearby basically because you need to commute okay you need to commute fastly so i can commute so i can commute fastly yeah so we were nearby and we were in like we're gonna call it the changing rooms because that's what it was basically we're in the changing rooms couple kids come in again talking about oh my god kayla like um joke man's just in the hallway he's trying to come and see you he wants to see you this and that um so my drama my drama teacher went to him and was like she doesn't want to see you you need to leave you need to get out of here right and how was i moving like some celebrity i was just <laughs> i was because um i had to get to the stage so i was walking from the changing room um all the way around to um the hall so you had to go like down the stairs down the stairs and then around and then he was there and i had to pass him so i was like my friends were like blocking me away from like this i'm trying to get out of there fast like that it was so funny anyway so that's what he was just trying to trying to long it out and trying to see me right so fast forward again lots of fast forwards the show is about to start now and i'm like cool he's gone everything's right somebody lets me know that he's sitting in the audience so i'm like he's sitting in the audience my heart starts pal palpitating it just starts beating fast <laughs> it starts beating bare fast boom 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 right and i'm like okay it's fine i'm the opening act so i have to be fucking amazing okay and there you know in my stand-up bed if you know how um hairspray looks i'll insert a picture right there but i'm just there in my stand-up bed ready to wake up uh oh oh woke up today you know um and my, the music starts yeah the curtains open literally like this and i saw a glimpse of him and oh my god i ran off the stage and you know what it was a bit more awkward for me because he was sitting right behind my dad like literally my dad was right there and he was sitting one seat behind him so i was like what are the odds <laughs> what are the odds right now okay obviously he didn't know that was my dad but for me, I was like, oh my god, what are the odds? You know? Okay, so obviously I seen that now and I'm like, oh my god, no. I ran to the side, the music stopped, they're closing the, the curtains back, and crazy um comes to me and she's like, oh, it's gonna be fine. You need to take a deep breath, this and that. They finally get him out of there. And this assistant head teacher like came to me and she kept taught me. She was like, You're not gonna let this guy ruin your time to shine, okay? Like, you can do this, gal. And she gave me this like it was, I think it was slime or like some type of stress ball. And she was like, hold this and look right at me. She, when she, when the curtains opened finally and I was singing, she was standing right there like, the boy. <laughs> I was like, yes, babe. <laughs> yeah, but because obviously I was really like anxious and nervous now, the vocals were not there. Um, worst performance I've ever done. I'm very sad. <laughs> I wish I had a video of that, but it's, it's gone forever now. I did the show, I did the rest of the show. What was in the show? Hairspray, there was Lion King. With the man There was fame and spectacles. Loads of things. It was really nice, other than the fact that yeah, but other than that, it was really nice. I really enjoyed myself, other than the fact that okay. <laughs> but it's really nice okay and yeah we ended the the night dandy i finished the whole thing um i'll see if i can find some pictures and just insert them throughout the video because this was like really good so that was my story time of my first kiss it was horror it didn't have to be that way he could have just said oh you don't want to be with me okay safe g but it wasn't even adapting and he was trying to long it out but we're gonna move from that i'm okay i healed comment down below your first kiss experience hopefully it's not as you know it wasn't that detrimental like it really wasn't that detrimental but for me in year eight how old was i like 12 13 oh my god my life would have been ruined um but yeah comment down below any like crazy experiences you had with your first kiss you know because life's hard out here yeah and i want to see your comments i want to see them i like every single comment guys anyone that's ever commented on my thing they know that i've liked it okay
okay you guys make sure you like give me a like please i love the likes for you then okay <laughs> make sure you comment comment down below um your first kiss experience hopefully it's not as bad as what i just said because as a 12 year old detrimental for me really detrimental and make sure you subscribe okay and remember don't ever ever man don't take yourself too seriously seriously seriously